Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Yomi Martins and welcome to Time Out with Yomi Martins. And um, today we are going to be talking about intelligence prime capital, frequently asked questions. These are basic questions that newbies would want answered and they want answered in the most direct and um, you know, clear way so that they can take a decision whether they want to subscribe to the robot or not. In this channel, Time Out with Young Martins, we normally talk about health, wealth, relationships, and today's uh, topic is uh, on, on wealth, obviously. I must be quick to make a disclaimer, right? In this channel, what we feed you is educational content, right? We do not recommend anything. You should do your own research based on the information you are giving and the information you source yourself to make the best investment decision that works for you. That's out of the way. I can now go into the frequently asked questions on intelligent prime capital robots. So let's dive into it. I'll be sharing my screen right now. I did a, a small uh, PowerPoint presentation, which I feel would be uh, worthwhile sharing here. So that's what I'm just going to do. And I'm also going to try and make sure that um, the presentation is as short and as direct as possible. Okay, let's start from the beginning. What is the intelligence prime capital? Intelligence prime capital is actually a fintech company that acts as a broker themselves. They are based in Toronto, Canada. You can actually check them up on the internet or if you have relations and all that stuff in the city, I'll be in the country, Canada, you can also let, let them um, check out um, the company's address as stated in their um, PowerPoint presentation, which if you request, if you join my group or contact me, I have my WhatsApp number, and I also have my Telegram group, the Cool Ninjas, and all that is like more or less like an investment club that we talk investments in cryptocurrency and, and forex trading. So you can buzz me up there to send you the PowerPoint either on my WhatsApp or my Telegram group, and I'll send it directly to your email box. Right, so that's out of the way. I've already told you what Intelligence Prime Capital is, a fintech company that acts as a broker themselves. Now, where is IP capital regulated? Because regulation is actually very important to all of us. Most of these platforms, investment companies, and everything are poorly regulated and end up, you know, um, making people lose money. So the most important thing for me is look, looking at an investment company that is actually well regulated. So where is in IP capital regulated? They have the Canadian registration certificate, the financial transaction and reports analysis center of Canada. FinTrack is the regulatory body that regulates them in Canada. And obviously Canada is a developed country. So I believe that they are regulatory uh, procedures will be stringent, right? In the United States of America, they also have the money services business license. That's another registration and regulation they have in the United States, right? And lastly, they also have the Australian Securities and Investment Commission, ASIC. If you have guys in Australia, they can also help you check this thing out. So basically they are well regulated in three major countries, right? So I think that should give you a measure of confidence. And if you send me a request for their PDF for you to check their license numbers on all these um, regulatory bodies in the three countries, I can jolly well do that for you, for you to do your independent verification. That would be wise, don't you think? Okay. Do I need KYC verification? Yes, you do. 
KYC regulation is important because this regulatory bodies are careful when it comes to anti-money laundry laws and um, identifying the clientele that companies that they regulate uh, deal with, right? So you need your driver's license, uh, international passport, or any other valid government-issued ID card. Obviously, we have the ID card of OKK and OKK and Sons, <laughs> or, or Yomi Martins and Daughters will not work in this sense. So KYC approval takes between a couple of hours or 48 hours at most, based on my experience. But you should note that you can fund your account while waiting for KYC approval, while once you are sure that you presented a valid ID. Now, how are IPC capital who are IPC Capital? That's actually an error. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. That's the title. Um, is actually should be who are. Let me just quickly correct that. Sorry. Uh, a bad omission on my side. I apologize. Who are IPC Capital Management? Now, basically. At the arms of affairs of IP Capital, you have Mr. Walter Stephan, who is the COO, that's the Chief Operating Officer of Intelligence Prime Capital. Who is Walter Stephan? He studied in London School of Economics and Political Science and has a master's degree in finance and accounting. After his master's degree, he continued his PhD studies in computing and mathematics from the University of Oxford. And I'm sure this kind of information is very verifiable because we are not talking about schools that are not well known. And they obviously have a standard alumni association in which you can actually verify their alumni members. London School of Economics, if you contact them, I'm sure they should be able to give you details about Mr. Walter Stephan. Similarly, if you contact the University of Oxford, I'm sure they should be able to oblige you the information required about the identity of Mr. Walter Stephan. Apart from Walter Stephan, we have Dr. Val, who has years of experience in financial industry from leading traditional businesses to financial technology companies. He has great knowledge on, the wide, on a wide variety of financial investment products from various precious metals, CFD, Forex, and cryptocurrencies. So he obviously has a robust portfolio of knowledge in this space of forex trading and also um, precious stones and, um, and, and all that. So you have a team of two main guys who are very vast in this field of forex trading. Now, what forex trading platforms does IP Capital use? They use the method trader for which I know if you're conversant with um, Forex trading online, you will know that MetaTrader 4 is a top-notch industry standard for Forex trading. MT4 is a trading software for financial products written by MetaCodes platform and is suitable for, financial, uh, for professional and experienced investment clients. So, IP Capital actually uses the MetaTrader 4. And on the MetaTrader 4, when you open your MetaTrader 4 account, you can actually monitor your trades, which most other um, um, companies do not do if they want to be very, very fishy with their transactions. You won't be able to know how much they are making for you. You won't be able to see the trades they take for you. But this is not the case. You will be able to see the trades they take for you and monitor it every day, Monday through Friday. 
And on Saturday, you can obviously take your investment out. Now, why choose IP Capital? These are the basic reasons you would want to choose IP Capital. They have a wide variety of trading products, including commodities, forex, and cryptocurrencies. They operate 24 seven, right? But basically for their forex trading, which their smart robot, brilliant robot, and genius robot are meant for, they only trade from Monday to Friday because of open trades so that you can cash out on Saturdays. Trade with the International MetaTrader 4 platform, which is an industry standard. Provide users with AI analysis system with an accuracy of 97%. Excellent customer service that provides timely resolution to um, customer complaints and requests and gives feedback. Real-time market analysis, because you can actually check your trades on a daily basis on MetaTrader 4 once you have downloaded the app. Fully regulated and compliant. The regulation, as I said earlier, is in three countries, Canada, United States, and Australia. Research and development team with many years of professional experience accept digital currency as payment, so you don't need to start transferring from your bank account in Forex to the trading platform. All you need to open is a cryptocurrency exchange account, and I will leave the link of various cryptocurrency accounts in the description section. You can have the link to Binance, you can have the link to Warby, and all that for you to open up. That is if you do not already have an exchange account. So it's actually convenient to international users worldwide. Now, do I need to know about Forex trading? No. You do not need to know anything about Forex trading. All you need to do is choose a robot of your choice from the smart robot, the brilliant robot, or the genius robot, which is actually my personal favorite, right? And download the MetaTrader 4 app and monitor your trades on a daily basis. Like I said, I have my WhatsApp number, which is um, very, very easy to access. And I've also um, put in a Telegrams group. If you contact me, I can always guide you through all the process of registration from start to the end. Now, what are the artificial intelligence robots available? You have the smart robot, which is sold for $19.90 or USDT. That gives you 9% to 15% monthly. You have the Brilliant Robot for $39.90, which is 15% to 30% monthly. I have the Genius Robot, which is my personal favorite for $99.90, which gives you an average of 30 to 45% monthly. Remember, these figures are not cast in stone. As I said, they have a 97% accuracy level. So there might be some variation. Last month, in the month of um, December 2021, the Genius Robot was actually able to make close to or there about 39% in trade for the month. Now, how often do the AI robots trade per day? Depending on the robots you select, the robot actually trades between, takes between one trade to four trades per day. A lot of people always ask this question, how much do I need to start? The minimum equity across all robots is a hundred US dollars. But remember, you need to pay a robot fee, which ranges from 19.90 to 99.90, depending on the kind of robot you choose. From the selection of smart robots, brilliant robots, or the genius robots, as the case may be. Now, how do I fund my account when I've decided to subscribe? There's a video that I will leave in the description section in which I describe how you can use the dashboard, the Intelligence Prime Capital dashboard, 
how you can navigate, fund your account, subscribe, and all that stuff. So we won't be doing that in this video. You can go to the description section and learn more on how to subscribe and how to fund your account. But right now, you can fund your account with using USD Tron TLC. That is very important. I've described how you're going to do that in the video in the description section. You can also fund your account using BTC. Withdrawals are in USDT TLC 20 tokens only. How do I withdraw my income? Withdrawals can be done weekly every Saturday via your IP Capital wallet in USDT TCL 20 to your exchange wallet account in USDT TCL 20 as well. So you can withdraw to your Binance, to your Huobi, to your uh, Bitfinex, to your Kraken, and so many other exchanges that you have out there. Withdrawals of affiliate reward, however, which is already in your IP Capital wallet account, can be done any time of the week because that does not affect your equity or your trading balance in your MT4 account. Also note that minimum withdrawals is $10 because withdrawal fee is $3 irrespective of the amount being withdrawn. Now, how much is the broker's fee? The broker's commission is 20% of the income generated on your trade. What do I mean by that? Assuming you were trading with $1,000 and you were able to make $100 for a day. At the end of the week, the robots will take 20% of the income you have made on that. Wait, you're trading with $1,000, you made $100 for that day. The robots will take 20% of that trade which is $20, and send $80 to your account in IPTC for you to now withdraw to your account or wallet in Binance or whatever exchange you may belong to. Now, can I withdraw part of my equity? This is one of the most important reasons why I love IP Capital. Because your equity is not stuck with them. You can actually withdraw part of your equity, as much as 80% of your equity within three months of your subscription. That means if you have $1,000, you can actually withdraw $1,000 in equity. You can actually withdraw $800 and leave $200 still trading. But you must note, because the minimum equity you should have should be $100, you should not withdraw the $80, 80% in such a way that you'll be left with less than $100 still trading in your wallet. That said, after three months, you can actually withdraw the remaining 20% of your equity. But if you do that, that means if you decide to come back to use the IP capital services via their robots, you will need to pay another robot fee all over again. How long does withdrawal take? For my experience, it takes as little as an hour, but other people say within 24 hours, your withdrawal moves from the IPC um, wallet into your Binance wallet seamlessly. I've had experience in which over time, I've actually withdrawn money in less than 30 minutes. Can I make money from affiliate programs? Yes, of course. That's actually the ju juicy part. A lot of other organizations so do it. So it's not actually peculiar to IP capital. Binance gives an affiliate bonus. Huobi gives an affiliate bonus. 
Royal Q gives an affiliate bonus. Royal Q is a trading robot. So many organizations use affiliate uh, bonuses and, um, and fees to encourage people to market their products worldwide. Now, you can actually make affiliate bonus depending on the rank and the volume of your team. You can make 10% from every robot you sell. So if you sell a robot for 99.90, you are actually going to be giving $9.90 on that sale, which is 10%. Now, if you introduce somebody that puts in $1,000 and trades for a week, assuming, just assuming, the person is able to generate $100 for that week, you will be giving 30% of the person you introduce, the income of the person you introduce. The person will still take his $100 after IP Capital has deducted the 20% commission. Will still take, assuming they deduct 20% from 80%, I'm sorry, from 100%. The person you introduce makes $80 and you now make 30% of that $80, even though the person is giving $80 untouched you will be credited with 30% of that value the person has made without altering the person you have introduced. That's smart. Now, that's it. A lot of you would have some other questions which I may not have covered. So kindly send me those questions you may have in the comment section. I would answer those questions as quickly as I see them. And apart from that, I've left you guys various links, various registration links, finals, other videos that may be useful to you. Uh, I've also sent you an affiliate link, just in case you don't have anybody that has introduced you to Intelligence Prime Capital and you wish to have somebody who would support your process and, and hold you every step of the way so that you ensure that you have success, please use my link in the description section and you can contact me via WhatsApp or through my Telegram group and I'll be willing to assist you. But in events that you have someone who has already introduced you, to intelligence by capital, kindly use the person's link. Thank you very much. Like my friends in India would say, namaste. Till I see you again, do have a lovely day ahead.